these 2020 World Juniors win or go home? First up, Switzerland and Russia. The scouts will be happy. It is the Southpaw. 17-year-old Yaroslav Ishkarov will get the start. He has stopped 41 of 46 so far in this tournament. And Luka Holenstein, who pitched a 41-save shutout over Sweden last year in the quarterfinal and is coming off a win over Slovakia. Burn back for Switzerland on for Abishir. Abishir trying to get it out. Lost control of it. Morozov is in. And a great recovery. Tim Bernie with a great defensive stick. He, he just delays. He doesn't really know what he wants to do. Tim Bernie says, okay, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to make sure that you have no play. Here's the hesitation here. Puts him. Todd pulls and lets a wrister go. And Holenstein makes the save. 4 nothing in game one of the relegation round this morning. Over in Ostrava. Chance in front. Oh, what a save. It's car off. 17 years of age. Make a clean play on it, and he leaves a big, fat, juicy rebound here, but the quickness, and you can see that Tim sets up the power play on the far side. Quad pulls and gets it in front, off the near goal post, takes this pass, takes a look, off the pipe. Kohler doesn't get to it, Gross holds it in, Gross doesn't shoot it, now he does, and it's Kara. Marchenko, to the line, drops it back, and he snaps shot there for to get up, stays in the action though. Slaps it from the line. That went wide. Mosier off the skate. Marchenko with another chance. Holenstein down. Makes the save. And Pod Colson with a couple of chances. There's off the skate of Mosier. And the chance for Marchenko. Well, here's that bouncing puck in and around Holenstein. And brings it down low. And now grabbed off by Knack. Zerubalov intercepts. Dishes it off. Gets it back. And he missed the near side. Hold it in. Shot. Rebound. Score. Dmitry Voronkov. The front of the area and the Swiss have been so good. There's the interception. But Denisenko says, hey, I'm going to get this on the net. Rebound, Voronkov. But this puck comes into an area where it's a little bit tougher for Hollenstein to control it. Voronkov of where the puck is, a quick turn, stick on it into the net. Learning attempt by Saul's Gever. On for Sopa. He and Sopa with the wrister. Came back to the front of the net. Sopa with another chance. Good stick left there by Kian Sopa. And they're not strong on it. And Sopa right here, but he has nowhere to go. Askarov is big. Ratisha had lost his twig. Pod Colson will take this to the net. Pod Colson. This is a defensive play by Pod Colson. He knows where he's going. If you're playing against them, expect him to be. Feeling was, and rightfully so, that Pool A wasn't as strong as Pool B. Here comes Fetter with the shot. And as Karoff makes the save. On Up as a goaltender. Lots of size. And, and one of the things as a goaltender you have to be able to do is, is you know, not have busy feet. Kuznetsov and Vladimir Tarasenko. There's a shot, save, rebound, score! off it's bouncing but you got to be on that puck a lot harder a lot stronger and Jobin's hungrier on it Askarov makes the first save but that was some really loose puck play and strength on the puck by the Russians and Kohler Kohler has a couple of power play goals in this tournament for Switzerland Rister from Mosier one last rush here with the man advantage Bernie will skate it in, dropped it into the slot, and knocked with the opportunity. This gets sent up the boards by Pelienkov. Marchenko will take the pass. Marchenko back to the score. What a pass by Marchenko. Home in the right direction. But as this puck kicks wide, Denisenko head up, look, and bang right on the tape. What a great play by Grigori Denisenko. You got to put that puck in a perfect spot, and that's exactly what Denisenko does. So pressure now by Russia. 
Nussbaumer plays it in behind his own net, but Voronkov gets there ahead of Abisher. Voronkov back for Miss Yule. He unloads. Cross ice pass. And looking for the high tip and getting it from Voronkov. In position where he can use enough of his body to just close it down. To stay deeper in the behind the net. One power play goal in this game. Shot from the line is at the line, Zamula. He'll play it across. Denisenko back at the line, tip in front, score! Moronko again. Starts on the stick of Denisenko, and then he gets himself low, and then it comes up high to Zamula, over to Havanoff, and right back down to the post. Quick puck movement, everybody moving to position. No chance for Holenstein there. He's got to try to... Patry lost control of it, but Colson with the... Ready to pounce, ready to take advantage of where an opportunity might ensue. He's right into the space there. And then the cross-ice pass got mishandled by Nussbaumer. Nussbaumer winds his way in, gets away from an errant stick. Abisher, who leads the tournament... For Switzerland, Mosier. So down by two, Switzerland getting its opportunity. Best bomber, near side, Gross. That's the and then here's the play by Gross, and Askarov just over in perfect position. And that goes off the stick and wide, comes around for Marchenko again. Plays it back for Bistuel, sends it to the front of the net. 18-year-old Askarov, who gets the start in this game and has been very good, and he's going to get tested here. And... What a terrific Sells play. Him. As he comes back, he realizes he's caught. So now he turns, but doesn't grab a little reach in there with the stick arm for positioning. And that's just a touch. Mayov right back in. Turns and fires to the short side. Time's been solid. No question about that. But the Swiss just have not been able to generate. Now and Zamula in with a wrister and a glove speed in the World Junior this many times. And there was Zamula head up. Russia will advance and the tournament will come to an end. There's Nikolai Habibulin.